All right, so first thing the woodworking is safety. Yes, I use these, they're big and stupid, but despite my glasses, this thing makes all the sand dust in the world get in my eye and it's the worst thing ever. Um, besides that, I found these pieces of wood on the side of the road and uh, no reason to put them to waste. So, might as well cut them. So one problem we're having is when the screw goes down into it, it's fighting through here before it gets into here. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to drill a big hole in here so that it pulls really hard from this piece of wood. Now you can see the screw will just kind of fall in, which is what we want it to do. That way, this will pull on that board. Oops, oops. So, okay, this is gonna be my push block, and I'm gonna need use it to push wood, so I need a rubbery surface, get a mouse pad, and uh, some rubber cement. That's all you really need. Alright, yeah I'm sorry, uh, rubber cement will not hold that well. Uh, cut this mouse pad off with scissors. Literally came from a Dell mouse pad. And uh, what you want to do is if you already put rubber cement, go back, lock tight it up. Alright, so the push block's done. Now you kind of need a push stick to go with it. So I got this design. I'm going to cut right here. Then I'm going to make a cut like this. And over here, like this with the jig. I mean, it's, it's big and downright bulky, but that's my push block. Just take it and 